What would your customers say if you would be able to reduce the footprint of your systems by 20, 30 or 40 percent? I've seen customers reducing their footprint by 50 percent and psst, I also will tell you how it works. So Within another video, I was talking about the T-piece manufacturing in general. Today, I would like to put the focus more on the coloring process, which I also described last time in principle. So, as we are all professionals, just very brief, we are putting a pilot hole in here, making a longitudinal hole, and afterwards having the coloring here flat and prepared for the welding operation. So this is the principal manufacturing of T-pieces. And the coloring process is great to manufacture T-pieces which are in accordance with the highest possible hygienic design criteria. Which means that the transition here from the main to the branch is as smooth as possible. However, what you're doing as well is you're incorporating some negative effects, possibly negative effects as well. What is that? It's the weakening of the wall on this side and that side. Um, that's due to the fact that you take out material and due to the takeout of material you reduce the wall thickness. Well, that's allowed to a certain extent with regard to the 11864 uh, norm by 25% and with regard to the ASME BPE norm by 35%. However, that's certainly the actual secret of the process to control these values, these thresholds, these limits in the best perfect and possible way. And how that actually works now, I will show you in detail very soon. All right, so now we'll have a look in real life how a CNC state-of-the-art coloring technology machine works.
pretty cool, yeah. All right, so now we have checked out how it looks in real life. Um, the question certainly remains, what does that actually has to do with the reduction of the footprint that I was mentioning in the beginning? I brought you some examples here, which are manufactured with the basic technology of coloring. And as you can see here, we are stepping into a three-dimensional setup here with a coloring certainly on this side and on that side as well. And both sides are manufactured with orbital welding technology. So highly hygienic uh, conditions being achieved in such a part. Um, and as you can see, with doing it by T pieces, you would have like a length of that part, which is roughly like this. So you can figure that's already a reduction of the length of roughly 50%. Or if you would step more even into space management and if three-dimensional bending for you is a topic, then that could be done on a such three-dimensional part as well. So this is the idea to give you some examples for manufacturing for special parts in which you can see that a perfect space management or a reduction of the space requirement within your system is really doable, applying highly hygienic condition afterwards as well. So I hope I could give you an insight into the technology itself and into the further possibilities. I would certainly be happy if you would approach us with further requests and discussions about your systems and would be happy if we find a solution together. Certainly I would be happy as well if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel and see you in one of our next videos. Take care, stay healthy, bye bye.